guys, it's Trish. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have a Dior hat collection for you guys. If you're new to my channel, please subscribe. Follow me on Instagram at Trish Trin. Use my hashtag CDRholics. If you want to share your post with me, I'll comment and like a comment on your photo. If you suggest a video down below and I choose your video, I'll give you a shout out. So all you have to do is suggest a video suggestion and also comment down your social media or your small business. I'll give you a shout out. And I do have a TikTok. It's at Trish Trin with two H in the N. I have been posting on there. It's for fun, really. But if you guys do want to take a look, it's at Trish Trin with two H in the N. And without further ado, let's get started with today's video. And I am also having a Dior giveaway going on right now. It's a Dior Mrs. Scarf. So if you guys want to enter, I linked it in the description box below. And also I put it up in the cards above. And let's just show you guys my hat collection now. So I am obsessed with Dior hats. I love Dior bucket hats the most. And let's start off with Dior bucket hats first. And let's start off with this one here. This one is the, uh, I think it's called the Small Brim Bucket Hat, and it's in the blue camouflage on the outside. And then the brim, you have the navy blue oblique, and this is only one side. So if you guys are wondering, all my hat sizes are 57. And this is how I wear it. So bucket hats, you're supposed to kind of just put this, and then you put it down, but I don't like to cover my face. So I like to put it back a little bit, and this is how I wear it how it looks and this is actually my first ever Dior bucket hat that I got and that and then that just like started like my whole hat collection kind of like I'm obsessed with Dior hats now I'm like I need that bucket hat I need that one too so yeah I have a lot of bucket hats to show you guys today but this is my first one I do love this a lot because I love the color blue and I'm my favorite and my favorite oblique is navy blue too so I am in love with this hat and this pricing um, I, oh, it's, wait, I don't think it's available. Oh, here we go. It's called the Camouflage Small Brim Bucket Hat in Dark Blue Cotton, and it is 810 USD. And I have another hat that is the same but in a different color. My hair is messy. But this one is in the green camouflage, and the tag is still on it because I have not worn it yet. It's still brand new, and it's the same thing. It, this, but the inside is a uh, black brim, black color instead of navy blue. Uh, here's the comparison so you guys can see the color. Blue and in black. And it's just the same thing, but in green this time. Ta-da! So pretty. I'm so excited to wear it outside. <laughs> but yeah, I just love your bike that bucket hats a lot because they're so comfortable and they're so trendy and just makes a perfect little touch to your outfit. The next bucket hat is reversible and this one is in the color brown or beige. So one side is all oblique in the brown oblique bucket hat. And this one is more like flimsy because you can reverse it. That's why it's not as sturdy as the other hat. So it's this side for the brown oblique. And then the other side, what you do is you just flip it over, and yeah, it's very <laughs> flimsy. Just flip it over like this. That way, when you wear it, it's just all beige on the outside, right? But then for the brim, you get the brown oblique. So I think that's very nice that you can wear it both ways. This comes in brown. There's also black and navy blue. So... This one, uh, let me see if the price or if it's still available online. I think this one is the Reversible Teddy D Small Brim Bucket Hat in Brown Cotton Blend, 680 USD. And then the next hat is still brand new as well. I just got it for my birthday. My dad gifted this to me. And this is the, I think it's called Mill Fleurs. It's for the flower design. And this one is reversible as well, which I'm so happy about because it is in green oblique. I don't have anything in green oblique. So I'm super excited. So this one side will be flowers. And then the brim, you will have green oblique sticking out. This is how it looks. Super pretty. I love the design on it. Great for spring. And then when you flip it around. Oh, and this one is uh, $900. 900 USD. And when you flip it around, 
And of course, you have to cut off the Christian Dior tag because you don't want the tag to be sticking it where you wear it on the green side. So, this is how it looks on the green oblique side. And I just, I just love this color. It looks so nice. Ta-da! And then the final Dior bucket hat is the Trois de Jouis. And this one has a much wider brim. This one is a part of the Dior Riviera collection, which is like the beach collection. I'm sorry the, the lighting is like super bright today. But Trois de Jouis, you get the animal print, which has, which has the lion and the snake. Uh, tiger. The tiger is on the top right here. But then around here, you get the lion and the snake. My bucket hat is in the color uh, blue. See, you can tell it has like a much wider brim. It comes in blue, gray, and pink. But I chose blue, of course. And this one is $820. And now moving on to a different type of hat. This one is called... It used to be called the Baker Cap. But now it's called the Dior Artie Cap with Veil in blue cotton denim. This one is 760 USD. And this is how it looks. It has the veil, like fishnets on top. And then in the back, it says Dior right here. And it has like the cap right here. So this is, oh, uh, also on the inside, it has the B and Christian Dior CD. And then this is how it looks. Do, do, do. Ta-da! This is such a nice hat. I love this one a lot. Looks really, really nice. This is actually the first Dior hat that I've ever got. Like, before the bike hats, this is the first hat I've ever got. And I got this in Las Vegas, where I'm living now, in the Shops at Crystal's Dior. And that's when I met Nadia for the first time. So, yeah. <laughs> I love Nadia. She is the best essay ever. She's super nice. So make sure to ask for her if you guys do come to Las Vegas at the Shops at Crystal's. And yeah, so this is the first ever Dior hat I got. And then later on, I got another hat that's like similar, but it's just in a uh, cotton. Uh, let me see if I can find it. Oh, here we go. This one is called the Dior Baseball Cap in Beige Cotton. This one is $900. You can also get it customized in the back. I think only three letters. So maybe an initial or something like a nickname, maybe a shorter version of your name. And it just says Christian Dior. Pairs in the front, and then this is how it looks. Ta da! Looks so cute. This one comes in, I believe, beige. There's bl uh, black, and I'm not sure if there's a, a blue. I don't think so. I think only beige and black that I see online, of course. But yeah, Ta -da. I still have not worn this outside yet because I feel like I love. Uh, Dior bucket hats the most and also like beret kind of hats. I haven't gotten a chance to wear this yet But eventually I will It's just because of COVID I haven't really been like going out too much. So I haven't gotten a chance to wear this hat yet next hat um, Was a part of I think the fall collection and this one is a really really nice color I still have not gotten to wear outside yet. Um, this one is a thousand and two hundred why it's so expensive is because this is in lamb skin. And I don't know, I just really love this one. I just love the color of it too. Um, I don't remember the name of this hat. Yeah, it's not online anymore. I, I don't see it. But it's in lamb skin. And this is how it looks. I like that it's kind of like a beret on the top. But then once you get to the front, it's like a cap. So I'm just going to put it on for you guys. So yeah, this is how it looks. And if you guys do purchase this, be very careful because it's lambskin and you don't want to like accidentally scratch it. It would be super sad because it's such an expensive hat, but it's really, really nice. And I really love the color that I chose as well. Ta-da! <laughs> I just love hats. And then, to my hats, I got two Dior Beret hats. So this first one is just a regular... This one is like really flat. Uh, this is... I think this beret hat is really good to wear for like even in the summer because it's really thin. You can see it's kind of see-through here. So yeah, it's super thin. And this is the back. It says Dior. But I like to wear the back side for the front. That way people can see that it says Dior. Right there. So yeah, this is how I wear it. That way people can see Dior. But if you want to put Dior in the back, you can. And then in the front, you can like pin a Dior brooch there. It still looks super nice. So that's just some other options. 
and this is no longer available. I have no idea uh, how much it is. Um, I'm guessing maybe 600 somewhere around there, I'm guessing. Um, but this is a really nice and cute beret hat. And then the final beret I have is the, what is this called? I think it's called Dior, um, is it also called a Dior Arty beret? I can't remember. But this one came in a lot of different colors. There's this burgundy one. There was like a green color. I think a black as well. But the green, I think, was only available in like Europe or Asia because in the US, I did not see the green because if you guys know me, I'm always scrolling through the Dior website and I like to change like the location. That way I can see like different items that are available from different countries. So I did see the green one, but it was not available in the US. But yeah, this is how it looks. It's uh, burgundy and also has like some white, um, I guess you could say it's kind of like tie-dye-ish in a way. And for me, I also like to wear it on the back side because like I said, it has the Dior pin right here. That way people can see that it is Dior. And it does match with my outfit today. Yay. <laughs> and that is the end of today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please subscribe to my channel. Follow me on Instagram at just trend. Use my hashtag cdrholics. Suggest a video down below. Take a look at my TikTok. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.